Hi. Um, welcome to today's cleaning video. Um, as you can see, <laughs> things happened in my kitchen and the rest of my apartment as well. It was my birthday yesterday and the day before, like, I've been busy. And uh, as you can see, a lot of things are now in chaos. So I thought, well, 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 I don't want to start a new week with this because I wanted to be over on Sunday. So today is Sunday and I made one mistake. My dishwasher was clean, like on my birthday. So my friends usually would put things in the dishwasher because they are super nice. <laughs> and we are all getting to an age now where you just don't put everything everywhere. But dishwasher full, clean, and they don't start like taking out the clean dishes. <laughs> so I've ended up with all of this stuff here. Also new today, hi, second camera. Don't know if it will always be here. Hmm. But I uh, thought, man, i just give you a different angle. Maybe if this camera has a glitch or something, hey, where have you? New microphone as well, so I don't know how that will sound. Birthday stuff. Amazing. <laughs> That's the reason why I can now have two cameras, because my phone is up there. Um, otherwise, I hope you all had an amazing weekend. I, for myself, might be getting sick. I don't know, I'm feeling a little low under the weather. Maybe it's allergy season as well, because today I was outside, yep, unexpectedly running a lot. Because <laughs> I, um, yeah, well, we, we, we gotta get through this mess, right? We gotta get through all this. I think I'll start with taking out the dishes, putting the, uh, all, almost everything I can get in there in, and then I will see how it, how it looks. Because um, today I was unexpectedly running a lot because I uh, supported my brother together with my dad on his first half marathon. Not his first, but his first half marathon um, through like, how to say, even ground. Like he did a half marathon in uh, the middle of Germany called for everybody who knew Rennsteiglauf. For the people who don't know, it's a half marathon, half marathon, which like goes up and down through mountain type things. Not like big Mount Everest mountains, but still pretty fair ups and downs. So today it was his yeah, there was just a city half marathon, so everything was mostly like flat. And he, uh, we, after my birthday week, weekend, having a party with my friends, then having a party with my family, then waking up early to go to a half marathon, um, I kind of did not expect, like my, my dad and I, we planned a route for us. Oh, there was still something in there, I checked it planned a route for us to walk so we can catch him at multiple uh, corners because you know if if the marathon is if this is the route we were inside the route so we had shorter distances traveled between each corner so we could catch up to him what i did not anticipate <laughs> was that my dad is also somebody who uh, runs a lot and also, also able to do the half marathon as well did in the past as, as well and on the first spot we were we didn't catch my brother because we missed him there were so many people there so uh, i texted him and he had his phone with him so he was like yeah i can give you my my life location so we knew ah no there he is and my dad was so like he wanted to get a picture. I, I did the video, you know, I did the phone video. I, I had my video, everything was fine. But my dad didn't get a picture and he was like, well, I have to get a picture. But he didn't tell me, hey, I have to get a picture. Let's hurry. He was just like, 
and I was like, run, run your pace, I will catch up. I had like Doc Martens on, it was fairly hot. And then I'm like running behind him. And then I heard people on the side, they were like, like a kid was asking his, his mother, what are these two doing? And she was like, well, they're probably part of some team and they have to make uh, videos for them and photos. And so they're trying to catch them again. And I was like, well, it's, it's, not, it's not not right. <laughs> we were kind of part of a, th a team, like a three band team. And, but we caught up in time and we got all of the pictures and everything we needed. My brother succeeded <laughs> or like uh, finished his half marathon with a better time than the last time. But he said <laughs> um, in the up and down, like the, let's call it off-road half marathon. He said he was very, it was very fun. And in kilometer 15, he had a lot of energy left. But here he said, kilometer 15, no fun at all. <laughs> no fun at all. And he was, uh, he was also sick last week. So he was just recovered. So also not a perfect peak, peak training uh, state one could be in. Still good enough. Proud of him. And, but yeah, that's the reason why I didn't have time to clean all of my apartment today. Basically, I, on Friday, I had the party. Then I, oh, this looks a little weird here. Okay, then we do this by hand. I had a party with friends, then on Saturday I went to my family. So this apartment was always in this state. And then on Sunday today, in the morning, still try to make breakfast somewhere here. Finding a space where you can you know, get some, cook some food and get something done. And then, yeah, be off again. So now it's night time. It's 10 minutes past nine. It's not night time, but it's like, is it evening, night? For some it's like that, for some it's like that. And birthday, birthday was amazing. All of you guys, thank you for wishing me happy birthday. It was very, it was crazy. I'm still not able to get to all the messages I got. It's crazy. <laughs> it's crazy. And I think that's the, that's the yeah. The headline for the whole weekend. It's been crazy. Um, I had some issues with getting older the past years because I was like, well, where am I in life? Mm, how, where would I want to be? Oopala. Where would I want to be with, in, in, with, with 25, 24? Everything seemed a little, yeah, just a little yeah, off. I wasn't where I wanted to be or where I thought I want to be. And so I had some issues with getting older because I felt like time was slipping away. But this year, it was amazing. I could take everything in. I was so, I'm so proud of the friends I have. I'm proud of the, yeah, the, the like, they showed up, they all had a good time, they all, um, yeah, liked each other, is maybe a weird saying, they all, like, I, I have, I don't have a big friend group of like, multiple people who we know from this, or who I know from the same, um, by the way, alcohol free, so don't, don't think there was too much alcohol involved in here, we're all fairly, reasonable. I don't know what this is, so I put it away. The thing is, some people say, hey, don't waste drink and whatever, but I don't know what's in there. And I have issues with other people's spit. <laughs> I mean, this <laughs> sounds weird. Let's say, oh, whatever, whatever, now it's out there. <laughs> but you know what I mean, I, I just can't drink it anyway. And so I rather get rid of it somehow. This is also basically empty. 
lemon juice. I don't know what's happened here. It's always so sticky. I don't know. I don't, I don't ask, I don't judge. Um, and also, I don't know if you're familiar with it in Germany, bubbles have something called in German Pfand, which means if you bring them, you pay an extra amount when, what hey, you pay an extra amount when you buy them, 25 cents, eight cents for glass bubbles. And if you bring them back to the supermarket, you can put them in a, like you can put them in a, what's called a machine and, and whatever, uh, which like checks if it's 25 cents or eight cents, and then you get the money back. So that's, and then they get recycled. I know this is not everywhere in the world, but I know it's in a lot of places. So if you're familiar with it, then you know. If you're not, then you're not, which is also totally fine. But that's the reason why uh, it's not rude if you leave uh, them here at the party because basically they give me money. <laughs> um, and also a thing I like to do is when, because sometimes I don't feel like get, taking all of the, you know, I usually live very, I don't buy anything that has, I don't buy stuff in bottles, not because I don't like bottles, but I drink water from the tap in Germany. That's totally safe to do. And that's it. And if I drink something, something else, I buy it very little, very limited, or I drink it in restaurants. So I never have, but not often do I have empty bottles around the house. What I do like to drink is um, at the moment, because uh, I'm on a diet, Coca-Cola, caffeine-free and sugar-free. So basically just black liquid, <laughs> but you know, if I want to drink something special, then that's my go-to because I'm not a big caffeine guy and not a big sugar guy. I don't try to, I try to um, prevent, prevent? I try to not drink too much sugar stuff. So also I had four, well, three cakes and one banana bread for my birthday. Like my friends are so cute. Like, look at these flowers. Like, what I said earlier, I was so proud of, I don't know, people I have around me. The things I do right now with you guys, the way it's um, progressing, progressing, developing. And also some idea I wanna share here, which is not just because, you know, this is not a big channel yet, and I know here are mostly, you know, mostly the super fans. <laughs> I don't actually I don't call you guys fans. It's the superhuman, <laughs> superhumans, man, crazy. You're all superheroes. <laughs> um, is I'm thinking about ways of monetizing uh, the content and. I'm very, very picky and thoughtful about collaborations and stuff. But I think, I don't know, apps, websites, programs who help us, for example, I don't know, meditation, mental health, things like that, which I'm not a specialist in, and I cannot help you with that, but I see that some of you, uh, let's say we all <laughs> could need support with mental health or stressful situations or et cetera, et cetera, you know, you know it. And I think if, 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 we, if I would co to collaborate with stuff like this, test it myself, and then, you know, give, bring it to you guys, I think it would be good. Tell me in the comments if you, if that is something that, you know, would work. Um, I think it's better than being like, well, these type of cookies are the best. Buy them now for $3.99 at your local supermarket. I mean, the voice is there. 
but I don't think that's the way I would like to go. If I do this in the future, you can take this part of the video, send it to me, and I'm, I'm going to explain to you why I said I made advertisement for some cookies. <laughs> Maybe then I really like them. Um, now I'm kind of at my end because this is already full, but I have so much. I thought it would look cleaner after this. I have a whole sink full of stuff. <sighs> How much time did already pass? This was only 10 minutes? No, 17. Sunday energy. <laughs> but I think it's better if I record it today where I still have strength left and I want to, like I said, I want to start into the week fresh um, and maybe tomorrow I'm sick <laughs> I don't know I do not know yet I'm trying my best not to also don't be worried I don't overdo it I know my body pretty well at this point I slept I met like I had a big nap today took a bath you know eat the things I wanted to eat I will go back to the diet tomorrow, but it's still birthday weekend and I still have too much cake here. So I have to eat some cake as well. <laughs> and it's also even maybe yours in a diet or you want to change your weight. Um, I saw a good video about that um, that said, don't think in a short term diet goal, you know, oh, I want to lose this and this amount in two months, six months, three months. Take it, think about it a little bit longer be consistent with it, still eat things you like in between, so it's not too boring. And it's basically all about calories. You know, you can eat stuff you like if it's within this calorie limit. If you don't want to be like super, I don't know, muscular, then you have to look out for certain protein percentages and whatever. I don't want to bore you with that. I'm not an expert in that either because I'm not finished with my diet, I cannot tell you how it went, but I know this weekend took a quick break. <laughs> took a quick break. Um, but a very nice gift I got. And I and I got if my friends see this, hi. I like all of the gifts. I just show this because it's here right now. And it's a little gift. It's I think it's icy, but it's not about the stuff that's in there. Because it's Dragon Ball themed. This is Goku, this is Gohan, and then there's Vegeta as well. And I know there are probably, my statistics say this, there are mostly women here. Bear with me, this is my hobby as well. Anime, yay. <laughs> and I think anime is for everyone, anyway. If you want to have a recommendation, Spikes Family and Frieden, F R. E. I always have a struggle with E and I. F R I E R E N. The German word for shivering or being cold. For the harder anime fans, Shokugeki no Soma. This is all I can wholeheartedly recommend to you. If you're starting out by X Family, if you watch anime a little bit, free run. If you're into anime a lot, Shukuriki no Soma. Let's go. Um, I don't know what this is. It's not that much in there anymore. I don't think this has any... Because uh, some, some bottles don't have this system I talked about. I don't know why. This is too full to put it away. So then you have to you have to like kind of put them to the in the trash manually or the recycling thing manually. I have so much cake in here, it's crazy. I don't even know how should how, how what do you guys do? You had a birthday, you have too much food left over. And you have like like I have cookies, I have chips. I don't eat them in my daily life. What should I do with them? Just eat them and be like, well, okay. One the whole week is going to be crazy with food or or what hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. also on Friday I did a birthday twitch stream 
Um, if you're wondering, I put all of the bottles down here. Um, because this is the place where I don't have place for it in the kitchen. Uh, alcohol, which I never drink, so it always ends up up here. And I have this, I don't know, a summary of random stuff I never drink. But hooray, what can you do? What can you do? I don't even know if this gold, this is not even mine. <laughs> And I don't know if this can go into the dishwasher. I assume not. I don't like things that are super sticky. I don't know what happens with, happened with that one. <laughs> when I saw somebody drink out of this, I don't know, old McDonald's 500 years ago mug, I knew that we were out of marks because <laughs> this is usually in the far, far back. Ooh. In the far back. And I don't know where they got this from. <laughs> I would never drink out of it, but because the secret it stood up there for two years without ever being used, then I cleaned it, but still I'm like, ah, no, nah, no, nah, don't, don't drink out of it. There was too much dust in there at one point. Um, but if you don't know, there's nothing in there anymore, it's cleaned. But if you know, you're always like, kind of like, ah, hmm, no, thank you. I'm not the biggest fan of uh, these paper bags because they're loud. <laughs> they tend to, they're hard to store. They're not really, you know, good to, to, to like fold. And yeah, sometimes they rip and then it's annoying. I like to have um, bags made out of fabric I don't know the, the right saying which you can use forever and they don't break on you and everything is cool okay question for myself do I oh, yeah okay I do this by hand you thought it's over it's not also I'm not a big fan of pulling this I like to pull the sleeve up on my hoodies but I'm not a big fan of if I do it too much, then they will, you know, extend over time. And then when they are down here again, they are not fitting as well as they fit now. Maybe there's not an issue for other people, I don't know. But for me, this kind of is the difference between a Sunday chill hoodie and a, you know, wear it out, in, out on, I don't know. In, 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 in public because <laughs> if the sleeves still fit it always looks nice when the sleeves are a little loosened it's just you always have to wear it up otherwise it, it looks a little bit like the hoodie is too big <laughs> but you know there are worse things Worst things that have, can happen sometimes on Halloween. Oh. I, on Halloween, I went as Freddie Mercury. So I had a, a, a moustache, uh, colored my hair black, outfit and all. And I painted my hair black, like with a one day kind of dye situation. Um, where it came with a spray, it's called spray, spray paint, spray thingy. And <laughs> like out of, the, out of a movie, I was, I was in the, in the bath room and there was a, like a chair and the spray can was on top of it, like upright, right? And I didn't see it and I sat on it <laughs> and it, my pants were ruined and spread black color all over my pants. Luckily, it's so like kind of deep uh, underneath that you don't really see it when I walk. Um, but I was like, what the heck? How can this happen? <laughs> and I tried everything. Put extra, let it soak extra long, get some special soap, everything. 
it's not coming off. I sh I'm sure there are some experts out there who know, you know, how to get rid of it. I'm at, I'm at my wits end and at my grandmother's wits end. And if my grandmother don't know how to fix it, who, 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 who then? Like the grandmother superpower doesn't work, then... Hey, the people also found... That's crazy. Okay, that's crazy. In this drawer, I have only little spoons and two, only two little forks, which I never, and I never saw both of them. I only ever see one because the rest is like buried or something. But my guest specifically found the two. I'm impressed with them. <laughs> um, if you want to know what my what my signature birthday cake is, in Germany it's it's called Maulwurfkuchen, which I don't know the English word for, but it's it's the animal that digs through the ground <laughs> and cannot see very well and it's like black fur I think and because it looks like the when they come out of the ground like it looks like the little earth um, it's not a mountain <laughs> the little <laughs> yeah the little earth things I don't know the language at all well if you know you know if you don't you don't it don't it's not important what it's called like but it's, um, it has one half had banana in it, one half had strawberry in it. And it's like chocolatey, fluffy cake with some cream on top and some chocolate sprinkles, I guess. Um, I still have one, one piece left, but I don't want to show it to you because it doesn't, it doesn't do the, the cake justice, how it looked like. Uh, when it was finished and in perfection. Also, I noticed that I'm not, you know, it's not very, I'm, was, I'm not very good at cutting uh, cakes. Because I feel like there, there are things you don't do often, which you, if you do it for the first time after a long time again, you kind of have to get back into it. And I think cutting cakes is one, is one thing with it, you know? You think, well, easy, but it, it was crooked, the line, the first line was crooked, so all the pieces of the first cake came out a little very uneven. And then the last cake I cut on Saturday went, went perfectly, but by then I trained on three other cakes. <laughs> What can you say? What can you do? I do think that I will leave especially these things here for the next dishwasher load because um, like there's some Coca-Cola coffee stains that I'm not very confident in or well, it takes just longer to get rid of them. I don't want this video to be, I don't know, 45 minutes long, which it may, be, may get that long anyway, we will see. But I rather want to spend the time to, um, you know, clean everything a bit. I mean, it's very late. I don't think I can use the vacuum anymore. So I'm gonna very, <laughs> very sadly br brush things off the floor, which you cannot even see in the video, my floor. But there's obviously a lot of, I don't know, mostly cake <laughs> is on the floor. Um, and also, these are my, I can never use the white plates because I have black ones and I like it. You know, I think food just looks better on black plates, in my opinion. And these were the ones I bought when I first moved in here with my uh, roommate. So these are mine. So, you know, why not use them the most? And yeah, that's when you, I don't have like only one of them I have a lot but if they are out then you know that a few people have been here also had some i thought 
I had some issues with uh, chairs and uh, didn't have enough chairs. Like all this stuff you never really need until you have people over, which is how often do you have people over? Like for real, you know, if you do the ground. Like it's not like that I have every weekend, <laughs> like, I don't know, 20 people over here. Everything onto the ground, I'll make it clean it anyway. And I know this is this is not the make the kitchen super clean kind of thing. This is more like make it work for like the week again, you know, so that you can cook your normal stuff in here. You can, you know, you find your <laughs> your things again. And most important, you have some clean dishes. Also, is, is there some more down here? Yes, maybe not enough. Cool. This I can take out to the trash. The rest looks kind of, yeah, it looks habitable again. Um, I think this can also go down here. And then, we good. I will still clean the floor after this, but as you cannot see it, it doesn't make sense for me to show it to you right now and I will just be out of frame all the time. I hope audio was great. I hope the second camera angle, which I didn't even use and look into, uh, was great. And I hope you have an amazing day. And I want to say it here again. Thank you everybody for being on this adventure with me, being on this journey with me, healing each other, what I said in my story the other day. And yeah, thank you for all the birthday wishes. And yeah. Have an amazing day and we see each other next time.